The magic man Antonio Tava said he fears for Anthony Joshua in his rematch against Andy Ruiz. Blessed love and blessed day, boxing world, boxing nation, fighting world, fighting nation. It's Coach Fire and this is real life boxing. The magic man Antonio Tava said he fears for Anthony Joshua in his rematch against Andy Ruiz. Hey, before we get into it, I'm going to ask you guys to smash the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell icon so you can be notified when new content is being uploaded and you can be notified when we're going live. Let's talk about it. Antonio Tava, the magic man, he did an interview. World Boxing News covered it. Let's go through it a little bit. Antonio Tava fears for Anthony Joshua and Andy Ruiz return. Former pound for pound number one unified world champion heavyweight contender Antonio Tava has given his verdict on the shock loss suffered by Anthony Joshua. Tava, like many, didn't see a dominant performance by Andy Ruiz Jr. coming when the pair met at Madison Square Garden. Ruiz managed to survive being dropped for the first time in his career to dismantle the pre-fight facade that Joshua was an unbeatable force. The Magic Man watched on in disbelief as Joshua crumbled on his United States debut in front of a packed New York audience. In hindsight, the Rocky Balboa star pointed to the obvious sign something was wrong with the British favorite in the build-up to the first bell. I was totally shocked while it was taking place, but after seeing everything that transpired, I'm not surprised it happened. Tava exclusively told World Boxing News. Drinking tea in the Yeti cup. Make sure y'all get a Yeti cup. I'm more surprised I didn't see it coming. You put everything together like the last minute replacement, Ruiz for Jarrell Miller after three failed drug tests. Also, him fighting in the US for the first time at MSG. Then his opponent's stature, the bookies odds and everything mounting up. It didn't seem like he approached this fight with the urgency he needed. It looked like Joshua was more surprised he was in a real fight. He obviously thought he could just turn it on when he wanted to and take Ruiz out of there. But when you don't prepare for the toughest fight of your life, it's hard to rise to the occasion. <clears throat> on what could happen in an expected rematch potentially at the same venue, Tava added, if AJ doesn't make the necessary adjustments, he'll most likely lose the rematch. Right now, Andy Ruiz is riding a magic carpet ride. He ain't trying to come down. It'll be hard for Joshua to defeat Ruiz in the rematch. That's all I'm going to read um, out of the article, but y'all see it. The magic man, Antonio Tava said he fears for um, Anthony Joshua in the rematch. Um, my opinion, man, everybody's counting AJ out. I guess just like everybody counted Andy Ruiz out. Um, so it's not surprising in the fashion that AJ lost in, but am I fair for AJ? No. One thing that I do agree on though is that if AJ does not make the proper adjustments that the outcome would probably be the same. But Coach Fire at Real Life Boxing, I kind of have faith in AJ that he will make um, the necessary adjustments. In no disrespect to Andy Ruiz, but we've seen Anthony Joshua um, deal with fast hands before and Joseph Parker, you know what I mean? Um, Joseph Parker wasn't as short, but we've seen Anthony Joshua deal with, um, with hat, fast hands before. We know that Anthony Joshua can box. We know that Anthony Joshua can use his jab and his straight punches. And we know that Anthony Joshua can use his legs. So um, with all of that being said, I'm not, um, I do believe that Anthony Joshua can come back in the rematch and fight the fight that he's supposed to fight that will get him his belts back. But what do you guys think about it? What do you guys think about the Magic Man's comments and thoughts on a rematch? Um, 
And what do y'all think about the rematch period? Talk to me, baby. Tell me what y'all think is going to happen in the rematch. Y'all know what we say at Real Life Boxing. First of all, it's a beautiful day out. And I hope that everybody is enjoying it. And I want you guys to stay safe out there. But like I said, y'all know what we say at Real Life Boxing. And if you don't know what we say at Real Life Boxing, it's peace and one love to the whole world. Not just the boxing world. Last but not least, make sure y'all protect yourself at all times, all right? So if you like this video and you would like to see more great content like this on the channel, go to the PayPal link or the Cash App link in the description and show your appreciation by donating any amount that you feel is equivalent to the value of this video. Thanks for watching. Thanks for the support. This is Real Life Boxing.